games, there are three voices. There's the voice of the creator, there is the voice of the game, and then there's the voice of the player. And that is what separates video games apart from any other expressive form of media that we have today. We are invited by the artist to inject our own morality, our own worldview, our own experiences into the game as we play it. And what comes out is wholly different for everybody that experiences it. And that's why it's important, because there is no other medium that affords the world this incredible opportunity. I want everybody that comes to this exhibition and experiences the materials and the work that's gone into this to understand that video games are more than what they thought they were when they came in. So the exhibition's actually broken up into three distinct areas. First area is, of course, listening to the artists, the designers, the programmers, the musicians talk about their craft, talk about the need. Tim Schafer and, and Warren Spector and Nolan Bushnell and you know, the, the people that were pioneers in storytelling. And so you get some background into what you're about to experience. So moving from there, we've chosen five playable games, one game that represents each of the five major eras. And these are games that allow people to experience games that propelled those eras forward, that created mechanics and storytelling opportunities that then other games built upon. And finally, you arrive at a place where you're able to actually see spread out before you the 40-year history of these games and the systems that acted as touch points within each of those generations. As you're experiencing the materials, you're actually able to see the evolution of the art, the evolution of the storytelling, the evolution of meaning of these games. But here are the echoes of the mechanics of those games all the way back to the beginning. Given the era in which certain games are made, the technology isn't present for the entire story, the entire narrative to emerge because there just wasn't space or power in which to do so. You may see Pitfall on the Atari VCS at the beginning of that uh, part of the exhibition and see Uncharted 2 at the end go, of that go. exhibition right, right. and understand that their origin of mechanics are the same. And that's what people are going to be able to experience. The creative process, the mechanics that allowed things to move forward, and the evolution of the form over time. So, you know, as people leave this exhibition after experiencing all these things, my greatest hope is they go home, re-experience these games in a completely different light. And they use them also to find connection that may have been missing within their own lives. Games are so much more than just code that runs inside of the computer. You are looking at the output of passion, of love, of art from the people who create these games. Uh...